out. Tonight, we have learned that the Boston police officer wounded during a Friday shootout is now out of the hospital. Kurt Stokinger was hit in the leg, but doctors cut him loose, and he's staying with family tonight. WBZ's Jim Smith is live outside Boston Police Headquarters for us now. Ken, this is welcome news for so many people. First and foremost, Kurt Stokinger's family, but also his fellow officers, the mayor, the police commissioner, and the entire city. Meanwhile, the man who police say fired the shot will face a judge on Monday. I am at 33, Mount Bowden Terrace, shot. It's the kind of call that gives even veteran cops chills. An officer down, shot by a suspect on Mount Bowden Terrace in Dorchester. Now, just a few days after his life was saved by a tourniquet, Officer Kurt Stokinger has been released from the hospital. Even on Friday, he was stable enough to speak briefly with the commissioner and mayor. Me and the mayor went in and we thanked him for his service. Uh, we told him, uh, you know, in our, in our minds, he's a hero. I said to him, I appreciate his service, I appreciate his bravery and hope for a speedy recovery. Sources tell WBZ about six shots were fired at officers. Police say the man who pulled the trigger was 27-year-old Grant Headley, who was arrested a short time later. Police say Headley is a convicted drug dealer who was out on probation at the time of the shooting. Officer Stokinger's wounding is only the latest attack against officers nationwide. We are the targets. We are the targets, and that's wrong. We are the men and women that are out there protecting you and this city. The public should not stand for this. It's outrageous. Officer Stokinger is said to be in good spirits, resting with his family. He's 37 years old and the father of two. Meanwhile, Grant Headley is due to face a judge on Monday. Live at police headquarters, Jim Smith, WBZ News. Back to you, Ken and Katie.